Hello from the Bayer Water Utilization Learning Center. My name is Alex Rosa, Learning Center Agronomist. In today's video, we are going to chat a little bit about early corn uh, planting and emergence. Okay, so come with me. Let's take a look on those corn plants here. Uh, so this area is under uh, management where we have no-till and cover crop. Okay, cereal rye cover crop planted in October 10th. Uh, 2022. Uh, then this spring we are conducting uh, a, a series of studies looking at different planting dates of corn uh, and we are terminating this ripe two weeks before we plant the corn here. So this first stop we're gonna be talking here like I said in a no-till situation. Uh, this corn here was planted in April 12th so our first planting date with about 34,000 seeds per acre. Now, the big difference when you compare the strip till with no till in this situation, and uh, we measured soil temperature last year to, to show that strip till does warm up soil a little sooner. The main difference here is the crop growth stage. So this corn here that you are seeing, it's in about V1 point something, almost at V2, but not quite yet. But when we see, and I'm going to show you pictures here, when we go to the, no, the strip till scenario, we are already on V2, almost at V3. So you do see that uh, corn planted in strip till conditions came up earlier uh, than this one here. And we are talking since April 12 on 284 GDUs since then. Let's keep uh, looking and see if our future planting dates will be impacted by this cereal rye biomass. So stay tuned for more information. Thank you. Thanks for watching this video from the Gothenburg Water Utilization Learning Center. For more information, please call 308-537-4500.